It's the big question on Kansans' minds this morning. In the next few hours, can critics of Governor Sam Brownback's education reform muster the two votes they need to block the bill? The bill passed in the House on an initial vote of 64 to 58. It needs only 63 votes to pass, so critics spent all last night trying to get the votes they need to stop it. The plan would give districts block grants based on their current aid for the next two school years while lawmakers draft a new formula. Brownback and other Republicans say the current formula is too complex, but opponents argue the legislature is moving too fast. A lot of unknowns with this bill it was rushed through. Uh, not a lot of people have had a time to read it, let alone digest it, so a lot of fatal flaws with this. This is not something that has been uh, just popped up overnight and surprised us. We've known what has been worked on and we've been, we've had the opportunity to be fully informed. Let's vote for security for the schools. To halt the bill, education lobbyists need to persuade two lawmakers to change their vote by this morning. We'll send out an alert as soon as the results of that vote come in. Be the first to find out by downloading the KSNT app or signing up for our text alerts at KSNT.com.